Ashley Skeva, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a smart playlist in iTunes. Now, creating a playlist can be really fun, but sometimes if you want a very long playlist, it can be a little bit tedious looking for every single artist you want. That's what makes smart playlists so great. You can take all the legwork out for you and make your iTunes do it for you. So let's take a look. So now that we're looking at our main iTunes screen, we want to go to File, and then we're going to scroll down the drop-down list and we'll see New Smart Playlist. So we're going to go ahead and click on that, and you're going to get a pop-up that's going to ask you to fill in some parameters. Uh, they're going to ask you for what's called rules. So this says match the following rule. Artist contains blank. So if you would like a playlist with just a specific artist, you can type that in. Um, you can also tap on artist and you'll see all the different things you can choose as part of your playlist parameter. So I like to choose by genre because that's always a fun thing if I want only dance music or pop music or rock music. So genre contains, and I'm gonna type in pop. And if you'd like to add another parameter, you can actually click on the plus sign right next to the parameter field that you're filling in and you can add another parameter to it. So if I want to say I want genre dance as well, I'm going to type in those two things and you can actually limit it to a certain number of songs if you would like. I don't want to limit it. I think I want a big long playlist as long as I can get. We can say match only checked items and you can also choose live updating, which is important because if you add new music to your library and it's a pop or a dance song, those songs will automatically be added to this playlist that you're creating. So once we put in our parameters and hit enter, you'll see pop dance. And here is our gigantic playlist. You can see there are tons and tons of songs as I scroll up and down here. And all you have to do to listen to them is double click on whatever song you'd like to start on. And if you'd like to shuffle your music, which is always nice in a giant playlist such as this, if you have maybe a party, you can always go to the bottom of the screen here on the left side and you'll see an intertwining set of arrows. And you'll see it says turn shuffle on or off and you can actually turn that on and it'll turn blue if it's on and you'll see all of your tracks now have shuffled together. They're not sorted by artist or album or anything like that. That's how to make a smart playlist in iTunes. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.